Hello, Police Best for UK here, and welcome to today's Game of Day video. Now, you can't have Atari Jaguar without Alien vs Predator. So, now, as you can see, we have got we, a few options here. You can have a look at the credits and the high scores. You can restore a save game, but I'm going to select the character so you can choose between the Alien, the Marine, or the Predator. So, we'll go through all of them on the video, and we'll start with the Alien. So as you can see the alien comes into perspective. Queen is gone, find queen, rescue, cocoon's vital to survival. Cocoon enemy with claw, tail, claw, and it says loud in simulation. So even now this is on a cartridge, it still loads it. Lots of the uh, textures and stuff. Now as you can see this is a first person game and wow, it's quite impressive actually. You are the alien, and you got this thing here, which you can use to attack your enemies. You can open the doors as well. So you're playing from the alien perspective. The atmosphere of the game is very good. Uh, it feels like you're actually on this uh, alien, mo this uh, m what you call it, close over air lock door first. Okay, so we'll do that right there. Oh, you fuck! Ah, the predator. Some of that. Watch out for this predator right here. Is that that other door's closed now? So I should be able to open the other one. Okay, let's go. Air lock pressurizing. So we wait for the airlock to pressurise. Don't know how long this takes. Is it open yet? There we go. Watch out for this marine right here. Have some of that. So I just got the marine right here. Graphics are very good. Uh, it definitely shows off what the Atari Jaguar is capable of back in the day. See that it's a 3D fully textured environment. Here we go into the alien world right here with the ship. Can I go through this door? Yes, I can. It's not too slow. That it's slightly slow, but it does it does seem to achieve a constant frame rates, which helps with the playability of a game. Oh shit! Watch out for these alien these are marines right here. Yeah. So that's the alien, so let's have a look at it from the, the uh, Predator's perspective next. So this time we're going to have a look at it from the Predator's perspective. So you can see it come into perspective now. Claim the skull of the Alien Queen. Attack when visible to gain honour and points. Lose points by killing without honour. Points gain access to superior weapons. Load in simulation. So this will load into it now. Press fire. We'll start off with the Predator. Now as you can see you're in Predator's world. Have some of that. So I've got the uh, the uh, marine right here. You can see that the textures are a lot different because I'm in a different part of the ship or a different part of the environment. Even now there's all these textures and stuff you can still see that the Atari Jaguar copes with it very well. It's not too, it's not slow. It's slowish compared to today's standards but it's not slow that it's unplayable. Watch out for this marine right here. Some of that. Oh, you fuck! Gotta try and get them at the right angle. So you, on the, you can have a map as well if you press one of the buttons on the uh, telephone keypad thing on the joypad. Pause the game as well. Now as you can see, you can, you can have your heat sensing view as well. This will uh, show you where stuff is and stuff in the game. Turn that off for now. And yeah, very good game. Uh, nice variety and the different levels and the different characters. So let's have a look at it from the Marines perspective. So let's have a look at the Colonel Colon Marine. So it comes into view. So security Brig 01 Auto Engage. Cryo sentence for 9126X complete. Prisoner name Lewis Lance J. Rank private. Offence striking an officer. Security card level 0 or D. Sentence deemed satisfied. Loud in simulation. Press fire. So we'll go into the marine view. Now as you can see I've got a different hood on here and we'll start off in the marine part. Can I do anything with that? No, I don't think I can do anything with that. As you can see, it rotates with the with the uh, the perspective, so that means that's a sprite. Most of the uh, stuff in this game is sprites. What on earth got a hold of this guy? And as you can see, I've just collected a shotgun from that dead body, and uh, yeah. So uh, 
I've got more of a Doom-like experience on the Marine because I've got guns and stuff. You can see I've got a shotgun right here. Again, you can put the uh, the map on if you so desire. The map will rotate in real time as you do. So we go through the door. Can you shoot this? I don't know what that's for, to be honest. So yeah, uh, here we go. See if we can find some enemies. Yeah, the atmosphere on the game is very good. You can hear that the the ships humming away in the background. It gives a good sense of atmosphere. Ah, here we go. Ah, he's coming to get me. Ah. So, once you kill the, the aliens, don't be careful not to walk on their blood because that uh, their body because it's acid and it like sort of kills you. Well, it deems some of your health away. Graphics are excellent, sounds good, uh, and yeah, it's a really, uh, really worthy addition to any Atari Jaguar collection. Um, really shows off that the Atari Jaguar can do F first person shooters very well indeed. The uh, PC version of Alien vs Predator, which come out a bit later than this, is n not the same game, so this is an Atari Jaguar exclusive, and this version wasn't out on any other system. So if you want to play this game, you're going to have to get an Atari Jaguar, or you're going to have to use an Atari Jaguar emulator. So yeah, anyway, so this is Alien vs Predator. And uh, I'm going to give this 9 out of 10. Absolutely superb. Thank you for watching. Goodbye!